How's it going, Connor here, and welcome to your Warrior 8 Finale Workout. This is going to take Train Like a Warrior to another level with this one hour complete total body blast. We're going to be combining strength training, calisthenics, conditioning, hit, cardio, abs, everything together within this one hour total body blast. We're going to break it up into four parts. Each part is going to last 15 minutes, and we're going to perform 15 different exercises in each section. 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, and as I said, it's gonna be combining strength training, conditioning, calisthenics, abs, everything together within the workout, okay? So we're gonna kick off with part one, which is gonna be strength training, and then we're gonna move and progress throughout the workout. So team, we're gonna take it to another level with this here, so I really want you to push yourself. And after you complete the workout, please be sure to send me over your progression pictures from the past eight weeks of Warrior 8, because I would absolutely love to see them. You can send them to me on Instagram or my email, connorstonefitness at gmail.com. And as you know, Warrior Squad is now officially live. That is if you want to take Train Like a Warrior to another level, you and I being able to work personally alongside with each other, our exclusive Warrior Squad community, exclusive workouts, nutrition, everything to truly help you maximize these workouts and programs. So be sure to get on that as soon as you complete the workout because I cannot wait to get working personally alongside with you. As always, before you get into the workout, please be sure to leave this video a thumbs up. Leave a comment below after you complete the workout. Give me your review of the past eight weeks. Let's keep on pushing forward. Smash that subscribe button if you haven't already and let's truly blast this one hour total body session together. Okay team, before I set the timer for round number one, I'm going to showcase the first exercise, which is a squat and press. So if you have the two dumbbells, squat down, press them right up like that there. Okay, if you're only using one dumbbell, a kettlebell, or even water bottles, whatever, whatever it is, hold it like that, come down, and press up and over. So this first 15 minute round is going to consist of some very good high intensity strength based exercises, and we're going to push through and then we're going to move on to the calisthenic part of the workout. So we have a 10 second countdown, 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off. Let's do this together. First exercise, squat press. <clears throat> okay. This is it. Big push now with this Warrior 8 finale. Squat press. I'm just using two lighter dumbbells today to bring the intensity, but if you're using one heavier or two heavier, just push out your reps, okay? Good or controlled. If they're a bit lighter, uh, push out the intensity. Keep it going. Go on, about five seconds remaining. Good. The next one is going to be a push up with a row. Push up, row if you're using the two dumbbells. If you're not using anything, do your push up and you can just row up with one dumbbell, a kettlebell, or even just your own body weight. Okay? Right, let's go for it. Push up, row. Again, this is going to be performed on the knees to modify it. Just keep pushing, come on. Every rep throughout this workout is gonna count. It's not gonna be easy, but it's gonna be extremely effective. One hour total body blast. Here we go. Five seconds on the clock. Good, okay, the next one is just gonna be rows. So bent over rows, coming up, squeezing like that. If your dumbbells are a bit lighter, keep the squeeze. If you're only using one, row up one or a water ball, whatever you're using. It's gonna to be tougher coming up than push-ups. Right? Let's go for it. Literally, it doesn't matter what weight you're using, you can always make it more difficult by keeping the contraction, keeping the squeeze at the top, bringing the intensity, really pushing it out. Come on, big push now. 10 seconds from in. Let's finish this Warrior 8 Total Body Transformation Program strong. Oh. 
Okay, the next one, core exercise, leverage with the weights or the resistance. If you have it, just keeping them up, going down. The two dumbbells are too heavy, just go with the one, okay? Just keep it pushing. Good, slow and control. I want to see your progression picture after you complete this workout. So be sure to send them over to me, even on Instagram or my email. <clears throat> and let's keep on pushing forward. It's gonna be your reverse lunge. Okay, so reverse lunge. Up with the knee, back again. Up with the knee. Okay, target the full body within this first round. Lunge it back, up with the knee. Back, up, power, explode. Let's bring the intensity here. You're gonna burn a hell of a lot of calories through this workout, but you're also gonna overload your body in a way that it hasn't really been hit before yet, especially with the increased work time and the combination of the wee bit of weights, body weight strength, hit, and abs. Ah, burning. Five seconds remaining. Good work, team. Right, the next one is sort of the chest press in your hip thrust position. So up high. So you're gonna be up and then just pushing out. But if your dumbbells are a bit lighter like mine, just wrap it out. If they're heavier, slow the movement down so you can pour. Doesn't matter how many you get. I'm using this more like to bring the intensity for me but you could use it as a hell of a lot more strength weight if you have heavier dumbbells or whatever you're using. I'm also coming down like a rotation at the bottom just to increase the range of motion. Keep going. Okay, the next one is a double press. So what that is, you're burning down with the weights, coming up, pressing up like that, back down again. If you haven't got the two dumbbells, you can burpee down, lift one up, back down again, or just do your normal burpee. Okay, if you really want to push yourself, you can push up on the way down, and then come up. Okay, you push up on the way down, and then coming up. This is a good athletic, explosive movement. Come on, every rep, let's get it. Nice, the next one is window wipers. Okay. Again, hold the weights if you have them, come down to one side, down to the opposite side. Woo! Exercise number eight. This isn't easy. All right, ready? We're gonna keep the dumbbells up. Gonna come down to one side. Down to the opposite. So you get that good stretch. Every rep counts, let's go. Keep digging. Oh. 
Nicely done. The next one is just jump squats with the weight, okay? I'm gonna grab this right. All right, get ready to go. Jump squats. Squat down, up. One kettlebell, just curl it up like that, okay? Feeling this already. Right? I'm gonna wrap it out, I'll stay a bit lighter. Let's go. Every rep. Big push here now for the finale. Woo! Go on. Ah, partner. For 10 seconds. Good work, right? The next one is like a high plank and a rotation, okay? Then I'm gonna go up. Gonna rotate right like that. Then I'm gonna switch. Right. Okay? If you haven't got the dumbbells, you can do that body weight even in the prime position and rotate up and round. Okay? It's entirely up to you. As long as you continue to move and push yourself. Side launches. Okay, so you're launching down to one side and launching down to the opposite side. Okay, you can do this with one dumbbell, volume weight, whatever it is. Right, let's go. You can hold the dumbbells any way you want. Some people hold them down there if they're a bit heavier. It's up to you, just try to keep moving. That's the key. Like that. Now, if you have only one dumbbell, whatever you're using, go with the one side, go with the opposite side. Okay? <clears throat> Alright, side raises. Body is feeling like this is only 15 minutes. This is part one out of part four of this, this workout. But let's keep on pushing. I'm telling you. This workout is going to be so effective. Oh, come on. About 10 seconds remaining. Oh. 
spread. Next one is Russian twist. Okay. I'm gonna use both weights. Up, oh, I'm twisting round like that. Okay, try to get a good rotation. Okay, two more exercises here, and then we're gonna grab the drink 20 second rest and move on to part two. Ooh, come on. You know yourself, you know how to push. Just keep on bringing the intensity. We got this. Okay, if you have a heavier one dumbbell, just go with one dumbbell over the head, or if you're using two lighters, up and over like that, or whatever you're using. Let's bring the intensity. This is the last exercise of this round. Right, I'm gonna wrap it out. Keep it going. Wait 10 seconds. Keep wrapping it. Brilliant team. Round number one complete. Grab a quick drink. We don't need the weights anymore. It's time to use the power for our body weight for round number two. So team, moving on to part two. This is the body weight strength part of the workout. We're gonna do the kick off the session, pulse in and out. So one, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. So we're staying low, so it's like we have body squats. Okay, 10 second count count, pulse in and out squats to kick it off. All right, let's do this. All right, so start now close. One, two. One, two, keep that going. This is no weight, it's just body weight. <sighs> My legs are still killing me from that 300 rep squat challenge. That was brutal. <sighs> if you haven't done that yet, be sure to go onto my channel and type in the 300 squat workout and do that sometime. Oh, legs are feeling this one. <sighs> oh. I keep digging. Burn it, go on, five seconds. Okay team, the next one is in and out push up. So in and out. You can do this just normal push up, walk out, wide. You can do it explosively, or you can do the more advanced version where you're bringing your hands and your feet out wide, in and out. It's entirely up to you. Again, this can be performed on your knees. Right, let's go, in and out. In, out. Let's go. Again, this can be done on your knees. You can just walk out like that. Walk back in and again. We're doing it all with this workout. Oh, come on. That's brilliant. Right team, next one is he's to heaven. Lying back, kick him right up in the air. I'm actually really enjoying this session. Though. When you break it up into these parts, these 15 minute sections, it really doesn't feel long. Flying by. Right, legs up, kick up. Oh, 
Always remember, the more intensity you bring to the workout, the better results. And I know already, so many of you have achieved truly incredible results, a lot more than you even thought possible. Ah, let's go. Keep it digging. Ah. Nicely done. The next one is our pulse jump lunges. This is a killer one. So we're gonna go one, two, one, two, and then continue. I'm telling you, you add that pulse in any exercise and it changes it. It makes it so much more difficult. Right, let's go. One, two, one, two. One, two, one, two. Let's keep pushing, team. Every rep. We got this. That's brilliant. Again, we do this without the jump. I'm only doing it to really bring the intensity. Ah. Ten seconds. Diamonds. Diamond grip push ups is next. Woo. Hard to beat the diamonds. Right, get ready. Let's go. You can do this on your knees, you need to. Brilliant movement for not only the triceps and the upper body, but also in case of the core. Everything is always interlocked with these body weight strength exercises. Go on, about 10 seconds. Cross body mountain climbers. So just crossing over like that. You go as slowly or as quickly as you want. Oh, body is burning. Right. Let's go. Crossing over. Find it hard to move my body up here at the minute, to be honest. Ah, uh, come on. Let's go. Five seconds. Oh, feel it. Next one is side to side jump squats. Okay, side to side. Let's keep the momentum. We're flying through this workout. Right, side to side. Just remember, it's only 40 seconds and then we have that 20 second of recovery. Side to side. You don't have to do the jump if you don't want to. You know, squat down the arm, walk to the side. You know yourself. Heart rate is up. Good, the next one is pipe push ups. Hips up high, able to get the nose right down. Brilliant movement to target the shoulders. Uh, let's keep it going. This is exercise number 8 out of 15 for the second round. Right, hips up. Come down.
Just dig it and re wrap. Good work. Okay, the next one is the reverse pulse lunge. So, lunge the back. One, two, up with the knee. One, two, up with the knee. Okay, it's the next one. Right, so one, two, up. One, two, three. So keep it digging. Every rep. This is not easy, but I'm telling you, this is extremely effective. You think about it. One solid arc of this type of training. It's just taking your results to the next level. Okay, good. The next one is the up and over. Okay, that's the core exercise. You're lifting your legs up and over like that there. Right, let's go team. Up and over. Just pretend there's something in the middle and you're lifting your legs up over the top. Brilliant exercise here for that lower abs and your obliques. Keep digging. About 10 seconds remaining. Fair ah. it. Ah. Nice. Right, the next one is the walk out. So we're starting up high and we're going down, walking down in the push up position and walking back up again. Okay? That's the next exercise. We're not far away. Right, so we're crawling down, and then push up, and then back up again. You don't need to jump, just up and down. You don't have to do the push up if you don't wanna. Let's go. squatting down and coming up with an alternating knee. Get that twist across the body. Let's keep it pushing. Right, squatting down, knee. Down, knee. Right, the 
next one is the rotors on bar. So we're doing one push up, one raise, two push ups, two raises, three, three, play the ladder. See how many you can get within the 40 seconds. This is actually 14 out of 15. Right? Let's go. One push up, one raise. One, two, let's go. That doesn't burn you out, I don't know what will. Morning. Ah, come on, you more it. Oh, I'm burnt out. Right team, the last exercise of this round is wall walks with bunny hops, okay? So, listen for my call. We're gonna do wall walks, and then whenever I shoot bunnies, we're gonna do bunny hops, and then we're gonna continue that. Right? Okay, let's go. Starting off the wall. Listen for my call. We wall walks, just forward and back, okay? Wall walks, wall walks, right, bunny hops, go, on the spot. Keep it going, keep it going. Right, more once. Keep going. Let's go, do not quit yet. We have a 20 second rest after this to grab a drink. Right, one piece. Ooh, feel it. Wall walks. Body arms, go, keep going. Right, back at the wall, keep it going. Forward and back, forward and back. Right, body arms, five seconds. <sighs> Brilliant work. Part two complete. Let's have a quick drink. Get ready for part three, the high intensity section. Okay, team, moving on to part three. This is the high intensity section. The first exercise before I set the timer is them squat jacks where we're coming down and up like that, okay? Exercise number one, let's get it. We're nearly there, we're at the halfway line now. It's not easy, but I'm telling you, the results that you're achieving, you already know yourself, it's insane. Let's go, it's all worth it. Oh, I wanted to make this final workout something to remember. You can always go back and test yourself with this session. Do this once a week. You're gonna take your results to the next level again. Ah, squad jacks, killer. Control the breathing, bring the intensity. Every rep counts. Ah, let's go. Legs are burning. Okay, team, the next one is the X perfect. We're going down, legs out like an X. Especially coming off these squat jacks. Ooh. Let's go. Right, X perfect, down, legs out like an X. And then back up again. Ah, come on. Every rep, let's go, let's keep pushing. By 10 seconds. Warm ah, Okay, the next one is plank get ups into one, two, three, four mountain climbers. Back down again. I am burning. Okay. Right, plank get up position. Get up. One, two, three, four. Back down. One, two, three, four. Continue. 
One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Keep it digging. This isn't solid. Being that one, that's for sure. Right, the next one is just a four to five round on one leg, so it's a wee bit less intensity, but it's still gonna burn. So you're just launching forward and back on the right leg first, and then you're gonna switch to the left leg. Right, so forward, back, okay? Keep that going. Just really focusing on that one side first. You're also getting the core engaged as you need to use your abs to really balance. Working on your stability. That's a burner off. Go on. Nice, right, we're gonna switch leg now. Okay. Let's keep on pushing. We're doing this together. Right, we're we'll going go again. Forward and then back. My left leg here is my stronger leg, so I'm finding it a bit easier to balance. Right, we have about five seconds. Huh? Right team, the next one is a burpee with a push up. We're just blasting this session right here. We might as well take it to another level here today. Right, burpee push up. Let's get it. If you can't get the push up, there's a bar, or even if you want to do it when your knees go for it. Just try to bring the momentum. You feel pretty good doing these workouts, so whenever you're finished, like already, I'm feeling so much better uh, than when I first started. Oh, come on. Okay, the next one is 180 jump squats. Oh dear, it's gonna be tough coming off them. So all we're doing is squat, turn, squat, turn, squat. Right, fine, 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 okay? Ooh. It's gonna be tough. All right, squat, turn, squat, turn. Ah. If you don't want to do the jump, you can just do the walk. Okay? This is brutal. Ah! You see me in as much pain. This goes to show you how real this is. Like, I'm absolutely burning. Come on, five seconds. Oh! That's the toughest exercise yet. Right, the next one is just toe touches. Legs up straight, touching the toes. Fair play to you for smashing this workout. It's not easy, but it's definitely worth it. Right, legs up, don't have to be that straight. Just bring them up and try to touch the toes. Even if you can't touch them, it doesn't matter. 
<laughs> Just go in like a cross position like that. Breathe a few times. Squat, kick it back. Squat, kick back. Okay. Let's go. You need to have fun with your workouts also. You need to put yourself in a mindset where you're enjoying them. Although it is so much pain, it's tough at the time. How good you feel afterwards. And you just want to make working out part of your lifestyle so you enjoy it. And that's why I can't wait to get Warrior Squad started and get working with you on a more, more personal touch. Let's keep it going. Ah, I'm burning. Okay, the next one is walk out. Climber. So remember at the start, we've done the walkouts with a push up, now we're doing the walkouts with one, two, three, four mountain climbers. Right, let's go. 20 seconds and we don't fly by. Right, crawl down, one, two, three, four, up. Jump if you want, push, back down again. One, two, three, four, back up again. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Go back down. One, two, three, four. Back up. Jump. Down again. One, two, three, four. Jump. One, two, three, four. Ah, brilliant. Right, the next one is T push ups. We're doing a push up going round up like that with a rotation. Again, this can't be performed on your knees. So many of you have been saying that you went from literally no push ups to now being able to perform a handful of them, which is insane. Like, push ups is not easy. Right, let's keep going. You can do this on your knees if you need to. Get that good rotation because you're working the abs here also. We have 20 seconds, less than 20 seconds remaining. Right team, the next one is a broad jump. Okay. We're gonna step back, jump forward, turn, jump back the opposite way. It doesn't matter if you're gonna use a small space, just get a small jump. Right? Let's go. Jump, turn. So hands up, behind the head, and you're launching back. And back. Okay. Launching back. Oh. 
Whenever you have the hands up over the head, it just makes these variations so much more difficult. We're nearly there, we've only two exercises after this. Right, I have two options for you. We can do the feet crossover push ups, okay? Or you can do the jump in and out mountain climbing training, just jumping in and out. I'm gonna go for the feet crossover push ups like that, okay? Or you can just do your jump in and out. It's up to you. Right, let's go. Or you can do a combination of both, do a few push ups and a few jumps in and out, like that. I am burning. <sighs> Toughest workout yet, without a doubt. <sighs> 10 seconds. <sighs> Come on, 5 seconds. Whoa. One more exercise, one more run. Right, best for last. One leg of barbecue. The, probably the most difficult movement you'll ever do, the one leg apart. Right? If you can't get it just yet, do your normal part by bringing it intensity. Right, part being down, one leg, up on one leg, jump on one leg, alternate. Push up, then I mean to. You can throw a push up if you want. Uh, that's a killer. Come on, 10, ten seconds. Five on the clock. Yes. Round three complete. One more round, and it's all abs. Let's get it. Team, the final round is going to be a 15 minute ab blast to finish off our one hour total body workout. So, the first exercise is going to be a leg raise with a kick up rotation. Right? So, up, kick up, out, kick up to the opposite side. Make sure them legs are coming out straight, they're coming up in, and then they're pushing out to the side. Okay? I'm going to set the timer here 10 seconds countdown, 15 different core blasts and exercises. We're going to bring the intensity to finish strong here. Right? Let's go. Kick it up. Try to kick the hips up off the ground also. Now, your abs have got completely blasted over the past three rounds of this session. So, it's going to be a struggle, but it's going to be a bright way to overload them. Oh, brilliant. Right, the next one is going to be the high climber. So, we're up high. Kick, switch. Kick in, okay? High climbers. Right, get ready. Go on, go on a few seconds. Right, there we go. Up, kick. Ooh. Up high, kick it in. Here we go. Ten seconds. Oh. 
<sighs> nice. Okay, the next one is a full body crunch. Legs out straight, hands up behind the head, and coming up, meeting in the middle. We've done this one a lot before with the core workouts on the channel. Right, ready? Full body crunch. Let's go. Right up and in. From breathing. Keep pushing. Try not to let the legs touch the ground. Keep it going, but can't say I can it. Oh, nice. Right, the next one is a plank twist with a climber. So we're all doing one, two, three, four plank twists, and then one, two, three, four plank climbers. That's the next one. Right, get ready. So, one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Keep pushing. Four. Let's go. One, two, three, four. Well, after burning, let's go. One, two, three, four. That is such a difficult variation. Right, the next one we're lying back and we're doing around the board. So legs out straight, going right up and around, and then back up around the opposite way. Ready to move that D table. Right, ready? Let's go, right up, around, and down, the bar on here. Whew. Feel the bar, feel the bar. <clears throat> that is a killer, especially if you're doing so in control. You just feel it right in the lower abs. is going to be Peaks of Heaven. Okay, lying back, kicking the heels right up there. Oh, grab a quick drink. Let's go. You can place your hands underneath your hips so you need to try to keep bringing the momentum here. Oh, that's a killer. Oh. This is not easy work, but it is worth it. Imagine how good you're going to feel when this section is complete. Oh, and how do you talk? Right, team, the next one is cross body mountain climbers. Okay. So we're just crossing over the body. Feeling glass little blinks. You should definitely feel that your abs are getting a lot leaner, stronger, more endurance. Let's go. One, two. You can go as slowly as you want or as quickly, but do try to get that good rotation. A solid rotation is a lot better than just trying to go fast with it. See it. Oh, right, 
right, the next one is four V crunches coming up and then four Russian twists. That's the next one. Not easy, killer combination, but all worth it. It's actually number eight. Right, team, let's go. One, two, three, four, four rushes. One, two, three, four, back down. One, two, three, four. Okay, so that and that is one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four abs are burning. Come on. Press cross is next. That's the one where we're just lying back, kicking right up and down. Third lady, we are smashing this here. 60 minutes, total body, training like a weird training. Weight, body weight, head, head training, core. All combined, mad, but what a way to finish. An incredible Warrior 8 program. Oh, this is tough too. Place your hands underneath your hips and knees. Keep it going, every rep counts. Every rep counts. Whoever says these workouts are not effective, please send them over to this session. Honestly, I'm sick of people just talking crap. They don't even go to perform the workouts, so they don't have a, a clue how effective they are. Like, look at the results coming out of this here. It's absolutely incredible. People saying we're getting better results here with these workouts than the work with personal training, boot camps, whatever else. Let's hold this plank. And where are we getting started? <clears throat> You want to make it a bit more difficult, you can raise the leg up and down. Do what you want. Five seconds. Right, that set us up lovely for the next two exercises. So it's a straight arm plank rotation. Pull the plank, arm straight, right up. Down and then rotate. We'll do that on one side and then we switch it off. Okay, we're nearly there. Up. Hold the plank on that one arm and then rotate. That's a brilliant movement. Absolutely brilliant. You feel everything targeted around the core. Boom. A few more seconds. Oh, I need a drink. So we're just doing the opposite side then. Exercise 12 out of 15. Oh, come on. Do this together. We're in it together. European is making. Let's go. Oh. You can see how much I'm struggling. So that won't ever be as hard as if you don't think you can perform the exercise right or now. That's brutal. Straight arm plank rotation, absolute killer, but super effective. Oh. Right, we've got 10 seconds remaining. Five seconds. Oh. 
Okay, the next one is four leg raises with four toe touches. We're nearly there, moving on the exercise, 13. Let's do this together. We are near the finish line. The final few exercises of your Warrior 8 program. Right, let's go. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. Team, there it is, your one hour total body warrior eight final workout complete. Just want to say a massive well done because that right there was definitely the most demanding workout yet, combining all different aspects of training to, to truly help you maximize your results. So, team, please be sure to leave this video a thumbs up, okay? Leave a comment below, let me know how you got on with the workout, and even leave me a review of your past eight weeks of warrior eight because I absolutely love to see and hear how well that you've got on with this, with this program because it really does motivate me. Also, be sure to send me over your progression pictures even on Instagram or my email, connorstonefitness at gmail.com. I don't need to share them, but it really keeps me motivated to see how much you've progressed over these past eight weeks. It's just absolutely insane with the incredible support that I've been receiving. And as you know, this is only the start of bigger and better things to come. All my workouts, all my programs will be here exclusive to YouTube. However, as you know, Warrior Squad is now officially launched and that is where you and I are gonna be able to tick the results to the next level, train like a warrior, truly on another level. I'll be able to work personally with you, a private community, exclusive workouts, nutrition, everything, so much more to really help you push forward and even just to support me so we can keep on pushing forward with training like a warrior. So hopefully I will see you on that. I'll have the link below that you can click and you can sign up and get stuck in straight away. And I really can't wait to see you over there. But team, as always, thank you so much for the incredible support. Please be sure to hit that subscribe button if you haven't already. Let's keep on pushing forward and I'll keep you updated with everything very soon. Brilliant work.